Hi everybody. Um, just wanted to do a quick video here. I was working on something here and uh, I thought I'd show you this little tip. <laughs> Might help somebody out. If you're going to do um, T111 uh, plywood in your... Hold on a second. Dog's getting after the cat. Hey! Enough. Sorry. Um, anyway, if you're going to use like T111 in your house for stuff, whatever, siding or whatever, um, if you're going to use it, when you buy it, it comes, it's pretty rough. Uh, I think you can get some sanded stuff too, but it's usually pretty rough stuff. Uh, turn this around and show you um okay this i don't know how that well this is gonna show up but this is part that i did this is a part that's not done it's kind of hard to see uh -huh. not done done um and here you can kind of see the stuff i'm getting off of it but um Take a grinder and a wire wheel and uh, run over, run over this, and it'll knock, it'll knock this real flaky, rough stuff off. And then what I'll do is I'll run, run after, um, after I'm done with this, the grinder, I'll run over the um entire thing with the belt sander 120 grit smooth it out nice uh yeah it cleans it up but that grinder cleans it up real nice for you then it's not so much sanding yeah you can get a coarse you know coarse sand belt for on there but it still takes a lot more time than doing it with this so well uh hopefully that uh helped you out you're thinking about using some T111 in your house um, or outside whatever but if you want to take that rough stuff off of there uh, helps out a lot so all right hope you enjoyed this little tip later God bless <laughs>